Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Noelle and I review and unbox subscription boxes here on my channel. And today I'm very excited because it is finally a monthly lifestyle box, which is really what I tend to uh, gravitate towards here on the channel, even though I've been doing a ton of book boxes lately. And when I do lifestyle boxes, they often have beach, Hige or travel themes and this one of course has a Hige theme. Hige, in case you are not familiar with it, is the Danish concept of coziness. It kind of embodies all of the fall feels and winter vibes that we are all feeling right now. This box has two different sizes. There is the standard box which is $42 per month plus $10 in shipping and then there is the deluxe box which is what I highly suggest doing. There's usually one or two extra items in that and that is $44 plus $12 in shipping. Doesn't doesn't seem like a big difference necessarily, that $4, but where you really start to see the savings is if you do multi-month subscriptions, which is what I do as a subscriber. I usually do three months at a time. One of these days, if I have a little extra funds, I will probably do six months or more just because this is a box that I really enjoy throughout the year. It is always a surprise. They don't really do spoilers over on their social media, but they do promise that there will always be an edible indulgence as well as an element of light. So we get a lot of candles and fairy lights lights. We get a lot of teas and cookies, all the kinds of things that I really enjoy getting in a box. Now I do have a referral link for you that I'll leave for you in the description box below and that will basically get you 5% off and of course anytime you use any of my referral links or affiliate links. It definitely helps support the channel, sometimes in the form of commission, but really just in letting these boxes know that this is where you found them. So let's go ahead and get into this box. This is actually the October box. I'm a little bit behind, but as some of you know, I'm going to be getting caught up pretty darn soon because for November and December, there are going to be two unboxings per day. So inside, all the fall feels with our little card and this really pretty uh, kind of golden tissue paper. So on the inside cover, the inside lid, they always tell you a nice long lengthy description of what Hyuge really is. It says Hyuge is a hug for the soul. You want a slice of that decadent chocolate cake? Eat it. Want to spend all night under a blanket with a cup of hot tea in your favorite book? We support you. Whatever it is that makes you feel calm and connected, Hyuge is fully behind you. And that was just like one of the short little paragraphs. So they always give us this kind of fun little like art print, which uh, a lot of different boxes do that. I think this would be really cute. If One of these days, I feel like they should give us a square frame for these little prints that they have. It just says shop Hyuge there in the, in the corner. And that would be a really fun way of switching up your decor because it does usually feel pretty seasonal. And then on the back, they kind of give us the theme. They give us like kind of some spoilers in the opening paragraph usually. And and then they tell us all about the items sort of in a fun narrative form, which I do really enjoy, although it kind of I kind of ruin it sometimes in the with the order in which I open the box. At the bottom, it tells us what the items are that are just in the deluxe box. So this is kind of good because the deluxe box has one extra item this time, and it actually didn't fit in the main box. The box and this extra item came in a mailer bag, so I already have it set off to the side. So what I'm showing you here will be in both the standard and the deluxe boxes. So let me go ahead and tear the old tissue paper, which I've, I've gotten a little bit better about it. Now I don't feel so bad. I just think of it as uh, extra tissue paper and packing materials for me to use in my own gift giving this season. So inside you can see it looks a little light just because we have one of the main items for the deluxe boxes off to the side here. But I do have one of my uh, drinks that we have. So I think someone told me that maybe they've uh, shifted their description and it's an edible indulgence, but also like something to eat and something to drink. Now I do feel like in terms of value, usually the edible items and the tea, they don't usually have a super high value. So if you're getting the standard box and you know, three of that, the four to five items that they promise are something to eat, something to drink and a element of light, that means you're really only getting one or two extra items. Um, now I will say I really love when they do fall and, and winter months. Sometimes we get some really cool kind of Scandinavian vibes coming from that, you know, inspiration of Hyuga, which that's what I'm really like looking forward to. So hopefully as you see this box with me over the next couple months, we'll get some really cute things. I've gotten like cute little like gnomes and decorations and little paper houses and been with this box for a while. <laughs> so this is from Plucked. It's hand-picked peppermint tea. So love that. So it's probably a loose leaf tea. We'll take we'll take a quick look. 
says this season is a, is a traditional time for many to embrace stillness and rest in a way that mirrors nature. It is a beautiful time to give yourself permission to pause and savor the joy of quiet. Take walks and read and lose yourself in the stillness, recalling that it's only by stepping briefly away from everyday life that you'll feel invigorated and replenished afterwards. Sometimes nothing feels better, calmer, and happier than unwinding with self-care, hot tea, and candles, and quiet joy. So, or candles, that's what creates quiet joy. So it was like M dash quiet joy. So here we go. This is what this looks like. I'm going to see if it is loose leaf tea. It says, make your tea hot on the sunniest day of summer. This peppermint is your breeze in the middle of the heat wave. So that is true. I think that's why I love peppermint flavors, just because it is so cooling. Oh, this is a cool like box. So yes, it is just some loose leaf tea in a nice little um, paper bag in there. So I will go ahead and put that back in there. It says simply take a deep breath and enjoy the celebration of nature. I'm like, oh, I can smell it. I can smell it. It smells really good. And it kind of wakes me up. It says with plucked peppermint tea, rich, delightfully crisp with a magical aroma. It has a calming effect on the body. Each plucked tea is naturally colorful and delicious because it's handpicked in wild Nordic meadows and forests. We love to hear that. Then dried naturally by the sun and the wind. Nothing but quiet mixed with gratitude. They should just say it's handpicked by fairies out in the forest. Um, <laughs> I guess they wouldn't be in the forest. It'd be like in the tea gardens. What, what, what is it? The fields. Tea fields. All right. What is this? Ooh, here's our element of light, everyone. So we have got a uh, soy wax hand poured in small batches. It's from Hamilton Wax. This is really cool. And it says that the scent is moss and oak. I am very excited that they gave it to us in a tin for a change. A lot of times we get a little glass jar from Hugie House. This is a better size candle than what we usually get. So sometimes you just have to remove yourself and leave everything behind. Go to the mountains, breathe cold, fresh air, sleep under the stars and indulge in the utter joy of a quiet mind. When you're not able to step away, burn Hamilton Wax moss and oak soy candle to bring stillness and calm into your life and that is so true I mean even though I work from home so you would think that my life would be really calm but I still experience a lot of anxiety just working uh, under deadlines sometimes being at my computer all the time oh my gosh you guys I can smell it I was like holding it far down here and all of a sudden I got this like little gust of, of wind where I could smell the, the moss and oak soy candle oh my gosh oh that smells amazing that is so, I don't know how to describe it to you. It's like, it's like being out in a forest, like without a particular scent overtaking every, everything. It kind of smells like a really good um, kind of fresh cologne that could be worn by man or woman. Like it's the kind of thing that I would love. Like this is how I want to smell every time I step out of the shower. Like I wish I could just automatically smell like this candle. So this might be a candle that I burn in the bathroom for this reason just because, oh my gosh, that smells so good. I'm going to have to look into the rest of their scents. They're out of Lancaster, Pen 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 Penna? Pennsylvania, I'm guessing. I don't know. So wow, it says it has 4.5 hours of burn time. It is eco-friendly and should have a clean burn. You guys, this candle smells amazing. That's really really nice um and it says it is eight ounces i think yeah wow so decent sized candle this time around thank you thank you hugo box here is our something to eat so i think maybe it is because i feel like back in the day when it was an edible indulgence we would sometimes get something to drink sometimes something to eat we didn't always get both so they must have like kind of shifted this looks like some fancy fancy chocolate milk chocolate popping candy it's by the chocolatier so look at the pretty packaging this looks like the kind of chocolate that i'd like see in a little shop you know like a card shop or a boutique that's just got like everything a lifestyle boutique and i'd be like that looks delicious but it's really expensive <laughs> so i'm really happy to get it in a subscription box instead <laughs> so let's see it says the chocolatier brings a deep sense of happiness with popping candy and delicious milk chocolate from java rich in notes of caramel and hazelnut oh yeah it says it's actually something deeper than mere happiness it's pure joy so they're really like driving home this quiet joy theme here they don't i feel like they don't usually like go for the theme that much but in this one at least in the copy they are going for it. it says changing the world one chocolate at a time together we're making a positive difference in supporting the education materials and food for children in india oh i think that's cool so it is 36 percent java milk chocolate bar experience the effervescence of popping candy with a delicious milk chocolate from java rich in notes of caramel and hazelnut um yeah that sounds good i think they're uh, out of britain i think they're out of the uk 
All right, very pretty. With my, I don't know, with my peppermint tea? Yeah, maybe, maybe. All right, you guys, what else have we got? Oh, are these reusable straws? Yeah, we got more reusable straws. There was like, there was a huge surge in reusable straws, I would say like a year ago. And I had so many different sets of like different materials and different bags. And honestly, I'm still really bad about bringing them and then remembering to bring them back in and cleaning them. But we got some more reusable straws. So if you don't get as many subscription boxes as I do, this might be a really exciting thing for you. Um, we got two of them though, so it looks like we got a little set. Uh, I don't know if they meant to give me two. I think they accidentally gave me two. It says, there's more to this elegant tea straw than meets the eye. It doubles as a tea strainer. Okay, so it's a little bit special. Uh, it says, for use with any loose tea, you can steep the tea right in your cup and then sip through the straw strainer. Traditionally used with yerba mate, we think you'll love sipping peppermint tea with this straw. Each straw comes with a cleaning, tooth, cleaning brush and travel bag. So this is a little bit like the brew straw that we got in my uh, Brio box. So here's our cleaning guy. Let me see. Let me see. I was going to see if there was like a tag. I can't. <laughs> it doesn't want to come out because it's not it's not super long. Oh, yeah. So this is like this is like a mate straw. So here it is. I don't know how you um, I guess you just put the loose leaf tea in your cup with your hot water it almost looks like a flute doesn't it like it looks like a musical instrument and then it's got this uh strainer here so you sip through that and then that way you don't get any of the bits of tea that's kind of interesting so i wonder if this comes apart um to clean it it's got to right because you're gonna get little bits and stuff in there so i'll have to like look into that i don't want to break it obviously so yeah i don't think so maybe it doesn't maybe you just rinse it because it's a strainer, so, um, but you can definitely get pretty far in there with your brush because it's very bendy. So yeah, you can get in there, clean it out. Even though it's got a little bend, I like that it's got a little bend, so you can use it with a shorter cup, right? Because I was like, I hope it's, that's why it's such a short, short straw because it's meant to be used with like a teacup. So let me just go ahead and pop that back in there. So that is actually a cool item. Um, I feel a little blessed that I got an extra one. That's kind of cute. Uh, so I will definitely include one of these in one of my future giveaways, you guys. Have you been looking for secret passwords? Let's see, it's like the fifth of the month. So I think there's been a secret password or two already announced this month. And you still have some time to get in on the October secret password giveaways uh, because I am away right now. So I am giving you until the 10th, I think, for the October one. So go back and watch that. There were 12 of those. Ooh, I love these, you guys. I don't use them a lot because I have eyelash extensions, so I don't like to mess up my eyelash extensions, but these are really cool. It's a jasmine-infused, self-heating, warm compress steam eye mask to help ease tension and encourage circulation, whilst the jasmine essence revives the mind. I always love when they use essence in the copy. So it says, put down the to-do list and take 20 minutes for quiet joy. Be at complete and utter peace with a self-warming steam eye mask that heats in 30 seconds, ease tension and encourage circulation while enjoying a jasmine essence that brings peace and calm to the mind. So they borrow a little bit from the uh, copy from any packaging, which makes sense. So let's talk about everything that we got in this Quiet Joy box. This would be the standard box from Hugo Box for October. We got our Moss and Oak Soy Candle, one of the best candles I think I've gotten all season. Um, definitely one of the best candles that I think I've gotten from Hugo Box. I love this scent i'm just gonna oh oh my gosh that smells so good we got some peppermint tea i love peppermint tea always makes my tummy feel better too if it's a little bit upset to uh enjoy that we got a really cool strainer straw that is meant for your tea um it's not fine enough i don't think for coffee but definitely for tea and i love that it did come with a little bag so if you're like a tea fan you can definitely do that and then so it makes a little more sense honestly to me to just go ahead and have a straw that does the straining instead of having to fill the little tea ball or whatever and then put that off to the side. And then of course for our edible indulgence, we got our popping milk chocolate. For those of you who are always saying, there's always dark chocolate and I like milk chocolate. I like all chocolate, so um, we got that. And then finally we got our little steam eye mask. So lots of things that give you those Hugo vibes, right? You guys, a candle, some tea, some chocolate, a warming eye mask, um, and a fun straw. And then finally for our deluxe box, 
we got, it says, always prioritize yourself and honor what you need, which may be stillness, soft music, a good book, or comforting warmth. What do you think? What do you think we got based on that description there? It says, for a relaxing self-care moment, heat this linen wheat bag to help you unwind and de-stress. It's also a quick and easy way to soothe away aches and pains in your shoulders, around the neck, or lower back. A perfect companion, always there to give you a cozy, warm feeling of security. So it's actually a really pretty pattern on there. I'm wondering, it says you can heat the inner bag in the microwave and then of course you can put the inner bag in a plastic container and freeze it for at least an hour if you want it to be cool. So it's nice that it is uh, versatile in that way. Well, let me go ahead and open it. It says flexible hot and cold pack for natural pain relief and general comfort. It might just be nice to feel that like kind of weight on your body. Um, so yes, let me see if I can open it. This is really a pretty pattern. So it's kind of a rougher texture. Yeah, it's linen. It's big though. It's nice. So you can see that it has like, it's basically a pillow cover. And this is the inner bag that you would take out to put in the microwave. You don't put the liner in there. But it's kind of this really pretty, it's, it is actually, I think, like an indigo, like a deep dark blue. Isn't that pretty, you guys? I think that's lovely. And it's nice because you could even put it across your chest if it's like a little, a little mini weighted blanket if you just need to uh calm yourself down. I'm looking at the, uh, yes, yeah, so you can definitely, it says micro oven freezer, heat inner bag only. So then I'm assuming that yes, you can wash the linen cause it is 100% linen. You probably want to like, you know, probably going to iron it. So it looks lovely, but I do like how natural and pretty it is. It's not like hot pink. It's not like, you know, super duper girly. Like this is the kind of thing that if you wound up leaving it out on your couch because you just were relaxing the night before, it's not going to look terrible if someone like surprises you by coming over. So I feel like you could just like kind of have that out. And that for me is really what I need when it comes to like using things that I get in boxes. Like sometimes I'm like, yeah, that's a great idea. I would love to use it. But if it is not like you know, it's out of sight, out of mind. Like if it is not in front of me, I will not think about it sometimes. So if this is like pretty enough to just rest over the, like the arm of my chair or my couch so that I remember at the end of the day when I'm making my peppermint tea and enjoying my chocolate, then maybe I want to go ahead and give my neck muscles a little relief. I mean, I feel like you could use it wherever you want in all honesty, lower back. Oh, that would feel really, really good. I think that is a great idea. So I'll maybe have that out. And then I like the contemporary vibes of it. Yeah, they're showing it. You can put it on your ankle. Um, they're showing a pregnant lady down here who's like using it, which there she is. So that's pretty cool. So I thought this was a, a pretty good box in all honesty. Um, you know, some, some months are better than others, but they usually do a pretty good job in the fall and winter months because that's when you really think you get. You guys let me know what you thought about it in the comments below. Let me know what your favorite item was. Uh, and let me know what your favorite candle scent is. Are you like a pumpkin spice candle person this time of year? I like all the like evergreen wintry foresty scents. That's like my vibes for this time of year. I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, please help me out by giving it a thumbs up. I would truly appreciate it. And I will see you all very, very soon in my next unboxing.